already know you want to add that to your collection, you can go ahead and order that one now while you're already on the phone or near your computer at hsn.com. All right. Ah, well, it's the first the I've seen it. the coin you were talking about. Well, it's the first I've seen it. Okay. I mean, we literally flew this in today. Wow. This was flown in today. Uh, this is oh, the gosh. 2016 yeah. brand new American gold buffalo, 24 karat gold. Oh, my god. Mint State 70, first day of issue, 116, already one of these gone, 116 mm -hmm. in the limited edition, uh, available exclusively from us here at HSN. Uh, lowest price I've done on the Gold Buffalo in its, I think, almost its 10-year history. It, for, this is its 10th anniversary. It's gone, this is the 11th year of, of, the, uh, uh, of the American Gold Buffalo. It came out in 2006. Uh, I know I've not done this price since 2008 oh. on the Gold Buffalo. It is the yes. only 24-karat gold coin that the United States government is going to make this year. I, I'm pretty sure about that. I don't think they're going to make the $100 Liberty this year. Okay. Uh, as you can see, 2016. I've got only 116 of them. Uh, one of the most iconically American coins, I think, that has ever been made. And look at that. Look at that. It is now the front of that. It was interesting. This is this is uh, based exactly on the original design by James Earl Fraser, who did the, this. Was originally it showed up on the Buffalo nickel, uh, which first came out in 1913. Uh, Unfortunately, in the nickel, we were not really able to capture the design as he intended it to be captured. And if we look at this closely, you can see that the background uh, around here almost has a hammered finish to it. Yes. And you couldn't do that in the nickel because it's nickel, and nickel's very hard. Yeah. Okay, so very, very difficult to do that uh, in nickel. So we finally get what he had intended this view to be of the American gold buffalo. Like I said, these are already selling very, very quickly. Mm -hmm. My next primetime show is actually next Friday. I suspect we will sell out then. We probably won't sell out tonight, although we're debuting this. It may come close. We're already in a kind of a hold situation if you're trying to call in on the phone uh, with this. And, you, and you're going to see this. Now, the front of this was a compendium. He had about uh, five American Indians sit for this okay. uh, uh, contemporaneously in, you know, at the turn of the century. Uh, and then this was his view, which is what kind of what makes it so iconic. Uh, on the obverse. Now, the reverse, interestingly enough, is actually a specific buffalo. Is that right? His name was Black Diamond, and he was the buffalo in the New York Zoological Society collection at the time. And he would sit there and uh, and Black Diamond, and he uh, uh, came up with that uh, a pretty magnificent specimen, as you can see there. Wow. And as you see, the way he, he's done that is you see the beautiful cape that's on him and all that. Now, the other thing is, is understand, this is not layered or plated mm -hmm. or vermi this is solid 24 karat gold My it goodness. wasn't that long ago mm -hmm. and i don't know uh, uh like 2000 and probably 10 or 11 2012 that we were pretty close to four thousand dollars if not over four thousand dollars on right. this coin right. uh, and understand the difference is that the price of gold has gone down pretty substantially at this point mm -hmm. and so because of that we're able to lower our price to reflect okay. the fact that it's an ounce of pure 24 karat gold and then the numismatic value the fact that it's mint state 70 absolutely perfect the fact that it's first day of issue which is exclusive to us here at hsn mm -hmm. the fact that there's only 116 of these for worldwide distribution you kind of put all of those things together and then put in the best price that we've had in pretty much the history mm -hmm. of the of the gold buffalo and in its 10th anniversary as well which is a very big deal as you can see right up there oh, 10th yeah. anniversary who knows what else the united states government is going to do for this this year but all i know is we have got this in the min state 70 absolutely perfect uh, uh, once again only 116 in the limited edition every right. single one of them exclusive to us here okay. at hsn so. and, and this is the thing this is your first time seeing it just like mike said mm -hmm. this was just flown in right. uh, this is one of those kinds of pieces that are extra special and i do recognize that it's not going to be for everybody but if you're looking at this and you are you know you're you kind of maybe you moved your chair up a little bit closer to the tv mm -hmm. and you're looking at it and you're thinking gosh that would be that would be a great ad that would be a great ad to my collection maybe you're looking at this and you're listening and you're saying okay yes it's perfect yes i know it's limited edition and then you're calculating and thinking that is pure 24 karat 
gold. Mm -hmm. You just, you don't see that anywhere. We don't see it in jewelry in this country. And even if you did, it would be maybe a chain, a, a skinny little chain, certainly not a full ounce of pure 24 karat gold in this $50 gold buffalo coin that even is extra special to us. Now, mm -hmm. you know, and, and, and I get ex extra excited because I was talking to Mike before the show and we've got a lot of great things, but Mike was saying, this gold coin, you gotta wait until you see it. Wait until you see how special mm -hmm. this is. Well, like I said, and because it's 24 karat gold, extraordinarily difficult to get in mint state 70. Because mm -hmm. gold it's is so soft. soft. Yeah. Usually, even the American Gold Eagle coin is made in 900 fine uh, gold to attempt to kind of get it to be a little harder so it takes the strike uh, uh, of the dies a little bit better. Uh, but 24 karat gold is just so, uh, uh, so incredible in terms of its fineness, in terms of its uh, uh, the way it, it takes the strike here. And so because of that, it's extraordinarily difficult to get this in, in very yeah. high grade. And so because of that, for 116, we literally had to buy hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of ounces oh uh, of gold. So you're starting to pray, you know, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars <laughs> right. of gold for us to be able to get enough coins to just get 116 of these, oh, as you can see, and already 2,000. 2016, uh, the yeah. first of the uh, uh, of the gold coins that, that that we're going to see this year, That's right. and like I said, exclusive to us here at HSN. Let me the jump grade in real being quick. everything. Yeah. Let me jump in real quick, and I hate to interrupt you, but I just noticed that our like I told you, our phone lines are really starting to get busy. If you can use uh, HSN.com, that's going to be a quick way. If you want to, again, stay on the phone, we'll definitely take your phone call and definitely take your order for this. But this is not, like I said, it's not going to be for everybody. Um, even, if, even if everyone wanted it, we just don't have those kinds of numbers. 116 period, and that's a hard stop. There's not 117. There's not going to be ever be 125. There's 116, and that's it. And we've got yours if you're calling in or if you're watching us right now and you give us a call right now. When I look at this, too, and I think 24 karat gold, Mike, there's something about the color of 24 karat gold that... That it's just, it doesn't, it, it's unmatched to anything else. Well, and if you look at it as we run it just like that, as I go back and forth, and it kind of, uh, it almost gives a movement to that buffalo there. It almost mm -hmm. looks, if I turn it just right like that, it almost looks like he's running. Yeah. You can see that because the gold is so soft, it, as I said, it takes the strike so well. Mm -hmm. So it actually shows, uh, uh, you know, every single part of the buffalo was originally sculpted as it was originally uh, uh, designed. And if you're familiar with the buffalo nickel, of course, uh, the raised ground that this stands on right here was only in the first year of issue from 1913. And this hammered look, we never really got to see a good look at that uh, 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 in the original coin. And one of the reasons for that is, of course, it was done in nickel, which is much, much harder, which holds up well in circulation, but doesn't do much for the design and beauty of the coin. So you've got this beautiful coin that's very difficult to get in absolutely perfect condition that we're going to go right there. And then you turn this over here and you see that and it gives it this, um, and, and it looks very much like a satin finished silver coin because of almost that glow that comes to it, That's but right. certainly uh, not the case. It is a regular mint state coin. And like I said, certified absolutely perfect mint state 70. First day of issue, exclusive to us. So by the time you put that all together, imminently collectible. My very first look, like I said, we flew this in today. Day. I was happy to. Uh, I was happy to see. Like I said, I was checking it out in between uh, mm -hmm. uh, during the break <laughs> there, so that I could get a, a look at it as well. Particularly in this 10th anniversary, which will be one of the more collectible years as well. So you have a certified 10th anniversary coin. That's going to add to the collectability to desirability uh, of this coin that's as well. Right. So right. there's a, there's so much value here. The the, mm -hmm. the numismatic value. There's the intrinsic value. These are the kinds of things that if you are looking to really build a solid collection. Um, th these are the kinds of pieces that you do want to add because the value is built in and it's not going anywhere. It's not ever going to be something that you say, well, it was really great in 2016 when I bought it, but now I'm not so sure. Right. No, it just gets better and better and better. And the fact that we have them for you now, the fact that yours will be numbered between 1 and 116 and that's it just makes it even more special. There's very few things that we, that you have an opportunity to get in life mm -hmm. that are this 
special and this rare and you're looking at your next one call us go to hsn.com if you have questions you know our customer service reps can answer questions for you but this is your time to go ahead and pick this up that's right a 30 day money back guarantee yeah. all of the things that make it uh that make it so desirable so collectible and so easy to buy coins here at yeah, hsn definitely so call us or again stay on the phone for that one if this one's brand new you're the first to see it so congratulations to you for those of you who are picking this up it's four seven four three seven four if you're still on the fence about it write that number down uh, and search